What's up guys, Takedown here with a product review. I don't do these often here on my channel, but when I do, it's a product that I really like and I use likely daily. So today's products, I am reviewing my book. It is a external hard drive, this is three terabytes. And I actually got this last summer. Like I said, I wanna use it for uh, some time before I recommend it to people and I highly recommend this product. I use this for my PS4. Basically, I was running out of space. I always liked making videos. At the time, I was only making gaming videos. I wasn't making videos like this back then. So I needed space in order to save my games, so I had more space for clips on my PS4. And I actually have this half full now. It's at 1.5 um, terabytes full, I believe. That's quite a bit, but I have all my games loaded onto it. I have no games saved on my PS4, and that's why. That's 500 gigs right there. But... I use this daily. I have it hooked up to my PS4, but you can use it for much more than just your PS4. You can use it for your desktop, your laptop, literally any device that has a 3.0 USB cable, and that's what it uses. So I do see a lot of people, especially for gaming, that go out and buy an internal one. What happens whenever that system is no more or you need to use it for something else? You can't. So this is for the type of people that need an alternative and they don't want to open up their system and put something else in it this literally sits right next to your system you put one wire into your system one wire into the wall that's it that's all you have to do and it actually works really well i've never had a problem with it they do recommend however in thunderstorms or if you know the power is going to be out on such and such day just to unplug it just to, so it doesn't get shorted out i've left it in two thunderstorms now by accident I usually unplug it, but I left it in two thunderstorms now and it did nothing to it. But I do recommend if you're going to, try to at least unhook it. But great product. Three year warranty, that's the best part for me. Three terabytes. They do make bigger ones now. Like I said, I got this last summer about. And I actually had a friend recently buy the same one except the four terabyte one. Since he lived in the States, it's cheaper. Here in Canada, this ran me about 150 but he got his four terabyte one for about 120. So kudos to him, I'm happy he got that. But if you guys see and you guys look up external hard drives, you might not have heard this one and you it doesn't say anywhere on it that it is used for gaming systems because it all, all it says is desktop on it. So a lot of people won't realize it, but PS4 uses the 3.0 uh, USB cable and that's what this has so you guys got to watch that some don't have that cable so you guys got to be really uh leery of what you purchase because a lot of it's non-returnable as long as it has that cable it will work and i have never had a problem with it that's my best best thing the one thing that makes me so happy is i've used it for so long it's never failed but you guys probably see that Xbox has their own version. I think it's a two terabyte. I think they have a one terabyte and a two terabyte external hard drive. All that is is a green, a bright green, uh, small little disc. This is a lot bigger. Not by much. It's not bigger than your PS4 by any means. It's about a quarter of the size, maybe a third of the size. But I just never felt comfortable with a Xbox item hooked up to my PS4. I never thought, I never wanted that. I never liked the idea of it. So when I seen this at Walmart, I actually looked it up a little bit and it, it, it was the item for me. Also it's three terabytes as opposed to Xbox two terabytes. And the Xbox one was quite a bit. This actually costs about 20 to $30 more than the Xbox one. And you get one terabyte extra. So I do recommend this over the, over the Xbox one. But let me show you really quick in my entertainment system where I have it set up. Okay, so here you see right next to my PS4, this is my book here. So reasonably smaller than your PS4, it is bigger than the Xbox version. All it is is one cord, it plugs into your device, and then it plugs into your PS4 or desktop or whatever you're using it on. And then there's another cord, you plug it into the device, and then you plug it into a wall outlet. So it's a really easy setup from what I've seen. This is the cord here, so it is easy. Normally you stand it up. Mine was getting tippy, and it was it was always tipping over whenever I went to pull out a game. So I just put it on its side, and it actually 
is way better because the vents are right on the back anyways. So it is way better to have it on its side. Then it won't even tip over or damage or anything like that. But give you guys a close up. It, it is a great product. You can use it on your PS3, PS4, desktop, laptop, any device you guys have. So the reason I am recommending it is because it's not just for a gamer, somebody that's going to hook it up to their gaming system. It can be used for anything. So if you make YouTube videos and you want to get something to save your videos on so you never run out of space, that's what you can use it for. If you do any kind of projects or anything you want to save it on, you can save anything on this, family pictures, anything like that. And it's cheap for what you get. I mean, three terabytes seems in a way like it's a lot, but 150 is what it costs me. Like I said, it's cheaper in the States and you get an extra gigabyte from what my friend got. Easy to hook up. Once you hook it up, all you gotta do is render it. I believe that's the right word. And it literally took me about 10 minutes to have it all set up and then automatically everything gets saved onto it. Sometimes you will have to change the setting because your original device is what it's gonna be automatically saving everything to. So it's just a matter of switching the settings, but I do recommend this. It's worth a shot. I went out on a limb. I didn't know if it was going to work because nobody said anything about PS4, but it works really well for the PS4. It works for desktops and anything like that, like I've already mentioned, but give you guys a back view. This was the one I got. I always save the boxes. Now I was going to make a review on this months ago before I even had the means to make videos like this and I decided to save it, but after having it for months, that's why I really wanted to recommend it and make a uh, product review video because it's something I've used for quite some time and I do know it and I do know it works. And I think anybody that watches my videos, it's mostly uh, other YouTubers or gamers. This is a product they could use. So that's why I'm just making this video. So I will leave this video here. Hope you guys did enjoy. Purchase this if you guys want. This is not a sponsored video. I'm just recommending a product I really live behind. And I really do recommend it to anybody. But I'll leave this video here. Hope you guys did enjoy. Please leave a thumbs up if you did. I will see you guys in the next one. Please take care. Peace.